Hey, fellow educators, do I have the tool for you to use? It's called Google Forms. Ditch your paper and pencil binders for your readers and writers conferring notes and switch to Google Forms. Your arms and your back will thank you, and you can access it anywhere, anytime. So in Google Drive, I'm going to go to Create and Create a Form. Okay, it's going to ask you to pick a theme. We're going to pick Reading, how appropriate for a reading Google Form. So once you're in the form, you can go ahead and title it, ask your questions. So what are some of the things that you'd normally ask in a reader's conference? Maybe the book type, maybe the level, um, you'd give a teaching point and next steps. So for example, if the first question here would be like the student name, so you'd collect that information. And look at the multiple um, choices that you have. That might be a choose from a list type of question. Here's how you edit, duplicate the question or send it to the trash. Don't forget to click here if you want it required so that you cannot submit it without answering that question. Click done, add another item. Simple as that. So here's a mock-up form and here you can see the kinds of questions that I've asked, like just the drop-down menus. Love this fluency score, that's called a scaled score type of question. So you've entered all this data about your students, where does it go? It goes into a Google spreadsheet and you can see all the information from the date and the time you took the conference notes all the way into every piece of information you've added. The nice thing is you can filter this. Instant strategy groups. So let's say I want to find out just the students that are reading at level M. I clicked on the filter button, chose M, and I can see Abby, Burton, and Courtney are reading at level M. Okay, I can even go a step further and find like who's, which students just need to work on rereading. Instantly pull them and work on that skill with them. Google Forms, Reading and Writing Conferences. Check it out.